On the other side of the bracket, the Covenant Lady Rams are 19-9 and, and also still in it to win it, preparing for Rock Springs out of Milner, Georgia in the Final Four. Coach Matt Chambliss and six seniors on the team just pulled off the upset of an unbeaten 20-0 Lanier Christian squad in the Elite Eight, seeking revenge after LCS knocked them out of the postseason in 2020. The Rams were back-to-back -back region champs the previous two seasons and were runner-ups this year. They believe they are peaking at just the right time when the lights are shining the brightest on the biggest stage. We're super excited. I kind of took a, a look back over the last few years with these girls and, and this particular crew on varsity over the last three seasons. Um, I was looking here at the notes. Uh, they've had 64 wins over the last few seasons. And so they've definitely been in the moment before. Uh, and so I do think that that helps. They know what to expect and they know how hard you have to work. And just because, you know, you may be ready for that moment doesn't mean it's going to go your way. But um, we have good leadership on the team and that goes a long way. And so man, they're, they're super excited. and They're ready to go. Now Covenant players on the Central Georgia Tech campus on Anthony Road in Macon Friday at 6.30 p.m. Central Fellowship will take on Sherwood Academy Friday as well at CGTC prior to at 3 p.m. Both teams are hoping to advance to the state championship at ACE at 3 o'clock on Saturday in the afternoon. If Covenant and CFCA both win, it will be their fourth matchup this season with all three wins in favor of the Lady Lancers. We'll keep you posted.